now we are discussing about countries in that we are now we are discussing about bhutan bhutan country a bhutan bhutan country is a buddhist kingdom on the himalayas eastern edge is known for its monasteries fortresses and dramatic languages land landscapes dramatic landscapes that range from subtropical plains to steep mountains to steep mountains and valleys in the high himalayas peaks such as 7326 million meters not millions 7326 meters jomol hari are popular trekking destinations paro takt sang monastery clings to cliffs above the forest forested paro valley so bhutan is this so bhutan is a buddhist kingdom of the himalayas on the himalayas 70% of bhutan people are 75% of bhutan people are buddhists and 25% are hindus then next point is uh, is bhutan controlled by india the bilateral relations between the himalayan kingdom of bhutan bhutan will be called as himalayan kingdom and the republic of india have been traditionally close and both countries share a special relationship making bhutan a protected state but not a protectorate of india this is the information so it is independent but uh, very friendly relations are there for it between india and bhutan is passport required for bhutan indian nationals intending to visit bhutan are required to carry any of the two valid travel documents valid indian passport having validity of minimum 6 months and voter id card issued by the election commission of india no visa is required to visit bhutan because because anyone is interesting to go to bhutan from india means they need not treat they need not to get any type of passport or any visa something if we are having a passport and voter id of india that is enough then what country wants bhutan next point is what country wants bhutan bhutan ceded the bengal juras to british india during the britain war bhutan war in the 19th century the house of wangchuk emerged as the nonarchy and pursued closer ties with the british in the subcontinent next point is is it safe to travel in bhutan 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 bhutan is a remarkably safe country with a low level of crime but at the same time growing with its population this is why you as a tourist should be very attentive as everywhere in the world while traveling how much next point is how much will a trip to bhutan bhutan cost how much will a trip to bhutan cost how much will it cost to visit bhutan depending on the duration and kind of hotel you stay bhutan travel can cost you anywhere between 35000 to 125000 we recommend you to stay we recommend you to stay at least 5 nights and visit thimphu paro and ponakha in the areas of bhutan that is and then uh, next point is what is the best time to visit bhutan the b- best time to visit bhutan during uh, spring months of march to may when the valleys come alive with the flowers in bloom be it in its uh, festivals and uh, festivities clear skies and glimpses to the himalayan peaks flourishing himalayan flora and fauna fauna 
or simply beautiful snowfall. Then the next point is how long can I stay in Bhutan? Upon entering Bhutan, all foreigners are issued a 7 to 14 days. Entry permit by default valid from valid for Thumpu and Faro Valley only. The rest of Bhutan is considered a restricted area and foreigners need a restricted area permit to enter. Then the next point is what language does Bhutan speak? Jonkha, that is D-Z-O-N-K, speaking language is Jonkha, official language of Bhutan. That is, the name is D-Z-O-N-G-K-H-A, Jonkha, is the official language of Bhutan, used mainly in the country's western region. Hindi is the official language of India, but it was previously used in Bhutanese cla classrooms. Bhutan is a multilingual country where approximately 20 languages are commonly spoken. Then the next point is what Bhutan best known for? Bhutan is colorful Buddhist nation that is known for its uh, serene natural landscapes and uh, spirituality. There are many monasteries here and the people are friendly and loving. Can you wear shorts in Bhutan? Next point is, can you wear shorts in Bhutan? You can't wear jeans. Wrap your jacket around your vest or have your jacket unbuttoned, unbuttoned or unzipped. Your jacket should not be unbuttoned or unzipped. Next point is, uh, and uh, then, then again is, uh, no hats, uh, shorts, uh, short skirts, uh, flip-flops uh, or t-shirts uh, can be worn inside. Then the next point is, is Bhutan open for its, uh, for tourists? Is Bhutan open for tourists? Is Bhutan open for tourists? Bhutan will start welcoming tourists from September 2022. Then which is the coldest month in Bhutan? There are significant seasonal range in temperatures. The summer months of June and August, averaging temperatures are 24 degrees to 29 degrees that is the summer temperatures are 24 to 29 means it is very low temperature when compared to india but in india the temperature will be around from 30 degrees to uh, 38 39 degrees are also there but here in bhutan in summer itself minimum is 24 degrees and maximum is the 29 degrees centigrade and then uh, compared to the winter months, uh, December to February, which are near zero degrees in Bhutan. Then uh, what is, uh, next point is, what is strange about Bhutan? It has the highest unclimbed mountain in the world. Unclimbed mountain in the world. Bhutan is home to the world's highest mountain that has never been climbed, living on the border with China and Ganghar. Gangkar and uh, Puyan Sam has an elevation of uh, 24,836 feet and is the 40th uh, tallest peak in the world. Then the next point is what is uh, Bhutan so weird? Weird means unusual. The highest uh, unclimbed peak in the world, it has an elevation of 7,570 7, meters. Bhutan prohibits access to the mountain since uh, uh, 1987. Before that, uh, many unsuccessful attempts were made to climb the mountain. The first team which tried, which tried to attempt the summit could not even find it because the maps were so in inaccurate. Then the next point is, is Bhutan a Hindu, a Hindu state? Mahayana Buddhism is Bhutan's official religion, Mahayana Buddhism, is the Bhutan's official religion and around 75% of the population are Buddhists, the remaining 20% are, 25% are Hindus. Then the next point is, uh, are tattoos illegal in Bhutan? Don't try to get inked. Tattoos parlors are illegal, but they are still increasingly popular with the young a government ban on tattoo parlors and tattoo art 
has forced the few professionals tattoo artists underground so tattoos are illegal in bhutan then the next point is uh, what is the main occupation of bhutan agriculture the uh, the economy of bhutan is based on agriculture and forestry which provide the main livelihood for more than 60% of the population agriculture consists largely of subsistence farm farming and animal husbandry then the next point is uh, how much will a trip to bhutan cost depending on your duration and kind of hotel you stay bhutan travel can cost you anywhere between 35000 to 125000 rupees we recommend you to stay at least 5 nights and visit thimphu paro and punaka these are the important places to visit in bhutan country this is the information regarding bhutan this information will give a basic idea to those who are interesting to go to bhutan wishing you all the best